Hello, everyone. This is your Sunday evening KRQE.com webcast. Ian Schwartz has a quick look at the forecast. Thank you, Tim. Under a very nice uh, ridge of high pressure, you can see here, keeping all storm activity to our north. Sunshine for us today. We'll continue this trend tomorrow. We're going to start to see that ridge break down and flatten out. Now, that's going to change our wind pattern from the northwest to more of a westerly flow, and that's going to help us warm up as we get into the next couple of days. So, what you can expect for your Monday is plenty of sunshine throughout the state, and we're going to have a uh, big time warming trend on the eastern side of the state near record value. Some of us will be flirting with the 80s as we get into Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. And then as we get into the middle of the week, we're going to get a shot at some snow. We'll have these little weak weather disturbances riding along this westerly flow, and then that'll help us uh, dra uh, drag some moisture in here and hopefully fire off some snow. Right now, it's looking like the northwestern and northern mountains will be favored for snow activity, but it's not really a powerful storm and not packing a big punch right now, so not expecting a whole lot. Here in Albuquerque, we're going to miss out as far as precip is concerned. Temperatures will be in the 60s to upper 50s for most of the week. Thank you, Ian. Firefighters raced to a house fire in Edgewood today, but the house is a total loss. This is what's left of the house, not much. The call went out around 1 o'clock this afternoon. When firefighters arrived, the house at Windmill and Horseshoe Bend Road was engulfed in flames. A lack of fire hydrants in the area made things worse. There is some good news, though. Nobody hurt. House was unoccupied. Uh, the owner was here when I got here, and uh, he confirmed that the house was, was vacant. It's unclear exactly how the fire began. Firefighters worked to make sure none of the flames spread to nearby bushes and brush. A fight led to gunshots at an Albuquerque motel last night. Two people suffered gunshot wounds. It happened at the Motel 6 at Coors and I-40 in northwest Albuquerque. Police say one of the gunshot victims was just grazed by a bullet. The other was taken to UNM Hospital, where he was listed in guarded condition today. One person was arrested by APD's gang unit. Stay with KRQB for more news and weather updates. I'm Tim Maestas. Thanks for logging on.